Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Bruce Stone, and I'm just going to quickly show you a quick tutorial on how to install Zom Mod Pack on Mac and Windows. Uh, I am using Mac, but on Windows, the instructions are basically the same. Use It's just a different directory for your Minecraft folder. Okay, so first what you have to do is you have to download this link from their page. And then, if you want some further help, just click on the instructions at the top of the page, and then scroll up and go to installation instructions. In case you're kind of lost during anything, and you don't know what to do. Uh, make sure your Minecraft is closed before you start anything. Alright, uh, on Mac, you're going to want to go to your username, and then library, application support, Minecraft and then open up your bin. This is where your Minecraft.jar is at. And that's what we're gonna need to access. So here you're gonna need to have um here you're gonna need to compress it. And then you just unzip it. Here and it'll come out as a folder. So you can just drag this out into your trash and then rename this to Minecraft. Well, let's just make it three. Then you gotta rename this folder that just came out of the compress file to Minecraft.jar. This way, oh, this way you can access all the class files. Also, you might want to arrange it by folders. So you can have all the folders at the beginning and all these. Alright, for, uh, for PC you're going to have to do the same, except your directory is going to be percent. You're going to go to the run and percent and type in percent app data percent. And it will take you to that folder and from there you find your Minecraft. And you open up your Minecraft with WinRAR and from there you do all your class files. So we open this and before we do anything we got to delete this, this stuff in the made it So we go back here it says, on my computers. Delete the only first two files. Delete only two files beginning with Mojang from the meta dot All right, so it's these two. So before we install mods, you delete the whole folder. But now you can only delete those two. On Windows, you just delete the whole folder straight up. Now from here, you open up the downloaded some pack and open up the classes folder. This is all the folders for all the mods, but if you only want to find fly mod, you only need the GQ, I believe. But I just installed them all, just for in case. Make sure you replace all, and apply it all, and here they'll be. So you're done with the class file. So now you need to go back to your main Minecraft directory. Open back up your Zom mod pack folder and go to the config. You see a file right here. This is config, but you don't go to that one. You go to, tells you right here, dot minecraft slash mods zone. So you're in the dot minecraft folder, and you, here's your mods folder. You are probably not gonna already have a zone folder, so what you do is you create it. Make sure that you spell ZOM. It's case sensitive and it's not zombie. It's a Z O M B E. Create that folder and open it up. And all these, you're going to copy and paste in there. I already have mine uh, customized like how I want, so I'm not going to. But after you finish that, you open up the config.txt. And you can go through here, and whatever mods you want to en enable, you just see where it says here. Mod cloud enabled, and you'll delete the little percent. I want to. I don't want to activate that one, so I'll leave. So let's go to fly mod. Mod fly enabled. Deleted that already. Equals yes. Toggle fly mode. I chose C. The way you fly up is with space, and basically here you can just customize it with the mod. With whatever you want. Um, the speed mod speed modifier is basically 
uh, how you make it when you push another certain key. So if I made my regular speed right here, if I made my regular speed 1.0, and then I made my speed multiplier 6.5. When I'm regularly flying, I, I'm going at 1.0, and then when I push Z, then I start going at 6.5. So that's if you, you know, you wanna don't wanna go too fast with fly mod, but then let's say you're in a hurry, then you can go very fast. When you're done with that, you just save it and close. And that's it. When you're done with all that, just make sure to open your Minecraft. Log in, and you should have no problem. This does work for uh, this does work for single player, multiplayer. Fly mod works for single player and multiplayer, but um, other mods only do work for single player. And here, I right, guess remember to read, comment, subscribe. Peace.